In Jeremiah 29, the prophet Jeremiah is speaking to the people of Jerusalem who were exiled in, in the wilderness experience of their own. These people were cast away from their homes and, and sent into the wilderness of Babylon. They were banished. They were deported. They were sent away under this worldly powerful king called Nebuchadnezzar. They lost their families, their homes. But somehow, some way, the prophet Jeremiah Yeremia, was prophet. able to send a letter with a message from God encouraging them. Each one of us have been victimized in some type of way. But because of God. We are still here. We are still here. All right. So I'm a survivor. I want you to look at your neighbor and give them a high five and say, I am a survivor. Oh, let's do another one. Let's do ah, one. Now, you know, if you have survived, something, know that you are a survivor. All right. The, the devil, uh, and the thing about this is, we still may be hurting, but, but not always hurting. The enemy may have wanted to take us out, but God didn't allow it. The reality about life is there will be hurt. You may have children with behavior problems, or as we say in the States, they may be off the chain. There may, you may have broken relationships battles in and outside of the church and there may be people working to push you into exile but God has given us a survivor spirit right, in Romans 8 37 it states in all these things we are more than conquerors through him who loved us and Paul Sac and Paul said in 2 Corinthians chapter 4 verse 8, Four verse eight. We are hard pressed on every side. But, but not crushed. Perplexed but not in despair. This is what we must focus on. Are we going to choose survivor or death? Success or delay? Sacred, the sacred or destruction? Surrender or depression? Our Savior or the enemy? Which one are we going to choose? We have a choice. Right. Choosing to be a survivor is a state of mind. And it's also a state of being grounded spiritually. But who chooses to be a survivor today? I choose to be a survivor. I see some survivors in the house. <laughs> all right, all right. Okay. And, and